Big news this week, right? Uniform unveiling. The uniforms are back. The colors are back. Most importantly, the colors, the bright, bright yellow and the bright, bright blue. Brighter even, I think, than what the bright blue and bright yellow was in the 80s or the 90s or the 70s. I think this harkens back to the 90s more than any of the uh, you know really successful decades of the 70s or 80s. But either way, the excitement was palpable. Everyone was over the moon about these new old uniforms that Pitt rolled out this week, the retro uniforms. And Pitt announced that they're going to wear them for the October 8th homecoming game against Georgia Tech. And if you probably if you go back to the this podcast in May, I talked about it at the time when they rolled out new uniforms and we got a hint that there were going to be retro uniforms. I said, you got to use them for a game like homecoming. Don't use them for a game like Penn State. You already have hype and excitement and 68,000 people at Heinz Field for Penn State. Use it for a game where you can actually make something out of the hype and excitement for the uniforms. And that's what they did for the homecoming game. Because the past few years, Pitt has not done well drawing for homecoming, or at least not as well as you would hope or expect to do for homecoming. And that's what Pitt did. They said, we're going to roll these out for the homecoming game. And I think they're going to get an attendance boost out of it. But then the next thing people said is let's wear them for every game. And apparently the players are going to have that option for the three remaining home games. They can vote for this uniform combination. And I initially said, yeah, that would, you know, if that's what the players want to do, let them do it. But, you know, it kind of occurred to me that I'd almost like to see these uniforms remain something kind of special. You don't want to make too much out of any one specific game each year, but maybe keep them to just a game or two each season. Maybe let the players say, okay, this week you've got the option to vote for these uniforms. And you know what? I wouldn't be surprised if even after the Georgia Tech game, the players kind of look at it and say, well, we'd like to mix and match with these combinations because as much as the players like cool uniforms, they also like to have those different combinations that they're going to have with these new, the, the new uniforms uniforms they already rolled out back in May these new uniforms from Nike so very cool rollout from Pitt very cool way to unveil it on Pat Narduzzi's Twitter but I'd like to see them maybe stay something rare something unique something special